I'm a teacher, and I have a question. How do I prepare students to succeed in the 21st century? Today, students will face challenges we haven't imagined, take jobs yet to be invented, and toil in a workplace constantly reshaped by the exponential progress of technology. Only one thing is certain. Classrooms designed for the industrial age will prepare students for this dynamic era. A new century calls for a new paradigm. So what's my role? We need to reset our sails and navigate these uncharted waters with our students. The sage on the stage must become the guide on the side. No longer the knowledge keeper, but the chief knowledge seeker, learning along with and even from students. Competency must shift from knowing the right answer to asking the right question. What kind of car will you be driving 20 years from now? Or will it do the driving? Will future conflicts be waged over oil or water? What do we do if sea levels rise as predicted? In reimagined classrooms where students become information producers rather than information consumers, questions spark curiosity, encourage critical thinking, and foster creative solutions, skills our students need to adapt to any situation and compete on a global level. How do I prepare for this role? First, by recognizing that our students, digital natives, view technology as an extension of their nervous systems. It has literally shaped the way they think. It's the key to connecting with them and a bridge to learning. The skillful use of technology puts the world at their fingertips, makes deep investigation possible, and provides a flexible, engaging format for project-based learning. So essential to building critical thinking skills and preparing students for the workplace. And where do I learn these skills? At a college of education that's striving to mirror the classroom and the workplace of the future. With collaborative learning, multi-platform competency training, and a philosophy that encourages teachers to imagine new and creative ways to reach students. What if I created a project that allowed my class to work with students around the world to document climate change? Could a teacher in Argentina tutor my Spanish students in real time? Why not? How can I design a project that gets my young students excited about the creative power of math? Do you think in 2020 that you'll wear your next computer on your finger or under your scalp? And what kinds of opportunities does that present? The 21st century provides enormous challenges for educators, but also boundless opportunities. The ability to inspire and unleash creative energy is unrivaled in history, and it all begins with a new paradigm for a new age. I am a 21st century teacher. I don't have all the answers or all the knowledge, but I can prepare my students to find the answers and to formulate the solutions. Because I have the key. I have a question. 